everyone, this is Susan Bewley from BudgetEarth.com and today I'm reviewing the Happy Dog Box. For those who hadn't heard of this pet subscription box service, they have all natural treats and um, premium toys for dogs. Now you guys have seen me review different dog boxes in the past and one of the things that really impressed me about the Happy Dog Box is it's one of the few I've seen that actually takes into account the size of your dog. Now for those of you who've been around for a while, you know I have a very large dog, an Alaskan Malamute. And unlike most dogs, they range around 100 pounds. So a lot of the toys that they normally put in these boxes are meant for little to medium sized dogs, which definitely don't work for dogs like mine. Now let's take a look at the Happy Dog Box. Now before I go any further, I want to let you guys know this was the box from December. So that you don't go, oh my gosh, am I going to get Christmas toys? Because no, you're going to get one that fits for the month you're getting the box. Sorry, let's see if we can get the box to stay open. Okay, first we have our card that talks about all the different treats. Here's everything so you can see it. I went through and independently priced most of the things that were in this box, and I came to it ranging between $40 and $55. So when I tell you the price, you'll see this really is an awesome deal. So we have an adorable candy cane. Now again, realize this is the box for large dogs, so if you have a small to medium dog, you may be a little freaked out by the size. So this is a giant candy cane. All natural rawhide. My favorite thing that was in here. Look at those. Aren't they adorable? They're little dog treats. I had never seen cookies like this before. Now, this is one of those things that I wanted to mention that all of the items that are in this box are not things that you'll find at your typical big box store. They are things you'd find in specialty pet stores, which we really don't have one in this area. So for me, most of the stuff I'd have to do here, I'd have to take a risk and go to Amazon or, you know, wait until we went back home where there is a um, specialty store. This I thought was pretty hilarious. Look at this. Isn't it cute? For those who hadn't seen a Monster Mouth before, these are similar to the Kongs of where a treat actually goes in here and they have to um, work to get it out. Again, this is the size of some little dog's mouth, you know, heads, as it would be for like my mother's Yorkie. So I take that into account. Nom nom nom. Some flushable doggy bags, which are really good when you're out traveling. Again, if you have a dog the size of mine, you may not want to try that at home. We have some peanut butter dog treats. And Rhea is going to be all about those. And don't worry, we still have more in here. Hard to believe, huh, everyone? We have a bully stick. And we have the last thing. We have a deodorant for the doggy, which is peppermint and, and tea tree oil. Sorry, I know that was probably hard to see everybody. And we have some shampoo and conditioner. Now, for those who hadn't tried it before, this the brand of this is Can and Able. I've tried it from another box, and I absolutely love their dog products. Sorry for the mess, since this is on my work area for the keyboard. But we have lots and lots of toys. Again, the actual price of all the stuff when I priced it out was around $40 to $55, depending on where I looked. And here is the really impressive part as I put everything back in. The most expensive that this box can be is getting it monthly for $25 or their three-month subscription. And if you want to invest in a six-month subscription, it is only $21 for the box a month. And these are delivered to your door for free. You know, you don't have to pay extra for shipping, which is something I'd seen with some of the other boxes that I really didn't care for. And the price doesn't depend on um, what size dog you have. And of course, the box may vary greatly 
depending on what size of dog you have. And for those who are wanting to know what the different size boxes are, there are three. They're small, which for dogs are for dogs under 20 pounds, medium for dogs 21 to 50 pounds, and the large box, which is featured here, is for dogs 51 pounds and over. And I believe that's about it. And I am looking forward to seeing how Rhea loves all of these awesome treats so far. I'm a very happy dog mom. There is a lot of very awesome things in here. And you will be able to see more of what Rhea thought of all of this entire box when you go to the blog. Remember, you know, you will find this review at BudgetEarth.com. And if it's not on our front page, you can look for the happy dog box in the search bar. Anyways, it's awesome seeing you guys this week, and make sure to check out the blog and the YouTube um, channel for more awesome reviews like this one. Thanks, everyone. Bye.